Hi, my name's Mia. I'm 16 years old and I was basically born with half a heart. I had my first open heart surgery at five and a half weeks old and since then I've had three more. Stem cell research has come so far. Right now we are producing beating heart tissue that may be able to treat children with congenital heart disease and we're really only scratching the surface. We've been really fortunate here at MCRI to be able to build a fantastic stem cell medicine initiative on considerable philanthropic support, but also government support. And I'm very excited about the opportunity that Renew brings. So Renew is actually the name we're giving to the Novo Nordisk Foundation Centre for Stem Cell Medicine, which is an international collaboration between the University of Copenhagen in Denmark Leiden University Medical Centre in the Netherlands and the Murdoch Children's Research Institute here in Melbourne. The most unique element of Renew is the model itself. There's really no other international stem cell centre globally that has the breadth of expertise spanning all the way from fundamental discovery science to clinical delivery of stem cells by bringing together these three world-renowned stem cell research institutes. This Renew opportunity is fantastic for the stem cell research that we do here in Australia to actually create that environment in which we can take our research outcomes all the way through into clinic. And I believe that if we do that, we will not only build capacity by training the people who are needed in that pathway right through to clinical delivery, but also attract international investment because this is really a unique model and a, and a fantastic opportunity. And that will put Australia on the map for regenerative medicine. The ultimate goal of this collaboration is to deliver new stem cell based treatments for currently incurable diseases in children and adults. This will enable outcomes across the full breadth of stem cell medicine, new drugs based on stem cell disease models, cell and tissue therapies and also uh, gene editing. I just can't wait to get started.